Uh, all right guys i'm back out here at my dovetail field i got about an inch and a quarter last night i just found this you know huge i guess it's a broken mono or a pestle or something it's a whopper i found four or five broken pieces nothing nothing real sweet in the way i broke i walked up on this and this thing the flint and i smudged it and i could tell it's wrong get it for you. Kind of got them parts missing, but all in all, I'll take him because I ain't finding hardly anything. I can mention I didn't think I'd find much in this field this time on account of it they just disc it they hadn't they hadn't deep plowed this particular spot and this is going on the second year and those little old kahawas or little bitty uh, fox valleys or something i like them pretty good just hard to find them with all the little particulars there let's keep on looking and i'm back Walked up on the tippage. Let's see what's on the other end of it, if anything. Well, I hope it's there. Things are scarce today. It sure would be nice to find a good one. Hey, it looks pretty good. Enough. It's complete. I don't know what it is. It's keeper though. We'll call it a keeper. It's a ground base. Well, man, I bet it's probably a, like a Kirk stand or something. If I find another in the table, we'll get them cleaned up and show them to you a little bit. Appreciate you watching. All right, guys. Never say never. And I can only hope. This right here is as good as what it looks. stuff I found which most everything I found was broken it's broken tools and scrapers that round rock it was on the campsite and most everything on the campsite is is shirt that they brought on there so I just brought it because I assume they brought it on there too this has got some awesome colors in there whatever the it is. It's a tool of some sort. And there's not too bad for a tool. Flake tool. And you've seen this, uh, I don't know if it's a grinder, if it's a pestle, or what the thing was. It'll be old tater. 
have gone. I didn't expect the, the field to produce a whole lot. Now I mentioned it already before. I said uh, they hadn't. There's a portion of the field they've only disc for the last two years. And last year they they plowed a portion of it. And I found some good stuff, and then uh, that's been that's been about it. They just disc it this year. What was plowed last year. That right there is a pretty good little piece, considering. Them are older points, early archaic. I think they're, can't pronounce it, K-A-N-A-W-A-H, canal one or something like that. <clears throat> this is a nice point. I'd say it's Kirk stem, or yeah, stemmed Kirk. Anyway, you've seen this heartbreaking piece right here. It makes me sick. And you know what? What was funny about it? Well, you've seen it. You know it. I could see a little bit on on this side, and I could see a little bit right here. And of course, when the way the mud was on it, it looked like it had a point. But then when you started moving mud, you know it went on up in there, and then unfortunately, tips gone. It's old, and that's old, but if, uh, you know, if that tip had been there, I'd have been sick over that shoulder right there. Still, it don't make me happy, but it's a, that's a nice piece right there, would have been. Pretty colors. I'd say it's pine tree. It's a broken one. And I'll show you something I made last night. It looks better than anything I've found in a while. I didn't notch it. Pretty thin. Four and seven eighths. Yep, that's better than anything I've found in a while. I like it. Big old blade. Blade's pretty flat. I'm off here. Maybe I can go to most stomping grounds Monday or so. I don't hunt much on the weekends. and uh, Get back down there after it's rain. See if I can't find something else down there. Thanks for watching.